This is a kit bag uh, made out of matches, would you believe, that was donated by John Ferguson, an old guy who he also did a couple of uh, mannequins, Trollman and his wife, which we have in storage at the moment. This is a kit bag and it's got 1850 names on it of lost Trollman, uh, my granddad's on it, the crew of the Fleming, the Gaul, and all the ships mentioned in here what was lost. And it's great, it's all been documented, it's great where people can come and actually see the names of their lost loved ones on it. Here we have a paper mache model of the statue of Lil Belocca. It was made by a lady called Gail Hurst. She made that one, the fisherman you're going to see in a minute who was cutting some fish. And these, are, these were on display in Holy Trinity, or Hull Minster as it is now, and uh, St John's Newington Church. And Gail asked us if we would like to display them in our centre. Uh, last year we've had them ever since. They survived the flood we had. They were un untouched, fortunately, because they've been paper mashy. They would have been a bit of a mess. But um, this is a little locker and a little son, uh, Ernie, and his a daughter, Virginia, have both been in to see the, the model and they're very pleased with it. The trollman made out of paper mashy and everything to depict a trollman on the deck gutting fish made by Gail Hurst, donated to us, uh, brings home, you know, how many times you had to bend over and throw fish into a washer every trip, a lot of times. That's why fishermen suffer with bad backs. <laughs> no. Next model you can see is the Kingston Topaz, H145, a steamship, one of the, uh, what we call triple bridges. She was a big ship compared to the ships that were in the dock at that time. Built in the in the late fifties, and she fished you know well into the towards the end of the uh, industry and all. Um, belongs to Kingston at that time. All the Kingston ships named after semi-precious or precious stones, like the topaz, the amber, the onyx, the the diamond, uh, etc. And uh, bought bought up by Ellie Brothers, and kept the Kingston name. But eventually they were all painted grey in Elias colours and uh, had an Elias funnel. So we lost the triple crowns in the funnel. But uh, yeah, we've got a good, a good um, class of ship, very strong with built uh, and, and, and a lot of money and you know, a lot of people enjoyed sailing in them.